What's up, guys? It's Big Chirpy. We're playing Hotline Miami. Enough said. We're going to skip this tutorial, or try to skip it as fast as we can. So I'm not reading any of this, because it's just telling me the controls of the game. I know how to do it. No big deal. Okay, get the bat. Absolutely, I can do that. This game is some uh, fast-paced, just some great twitch reflex gameplay for the pros, uh, naturally. Come on. Uh, a lot of tutorial, but that's okay. Once you get through the tutorial, this game is really great. It's also uh, one of the most violent games I've ever seen. Uh, so it's a lot of fun. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Part one. Phone calls. Um, Alright, let's get into this. And who do we have here? Oh, you don't know who you are. Maybe we should leave it that way. But I know you. Look at my face, we've met before. Haven't we? I don't know you. <laughs> Why are you here? I'll, look, I'll try to look at him. Why are you here? You're no guest of mine. Do you really want me to reveal who you are? Knowing oneself means acknowledging one's actions. As of lately, you've done some terrible things. Oh jeez, what are they? You don't remember me? I'll give you a clue. Does April the 3rd mean anything to you? It does not. I believe that that was the first day of our first encounter. You look like you might be remembering something. I am personally not. I don't know about the character in the game. Here it is. April 3rd, 1989, Miami, Florida. So I guess, yeah, this is my apartment. It's all kind of coming back here a little bit. Now, I, I have, um, I will just say for the record, I have played bits of this game. I never actually uh, played it all the way through. Um, so... It's gonna be, it's been a really long time. It, it is, again, just a little bit of an older game, but totally worth it, I think. I think this is, like, one of the best, best games around, actually. Got a message, okay. Hi, this is Tim at the bakery. The cookies that you ordered should be delivered by now. A list of ingredients are included. Make sure that you read them carefully. That's kind of ominous, isn't it? Click. So again, I, um, to give a little bit of a description of what this game is, it's kind of hard to describe, but, um, it's basically like a psychotic murder simulator. I think that's pretty fair to say. Like a psychotic, uh, just crazy drug-induced episode where you, you just you kill a lot of people. Um, yeah, so it's pretty good. So here's our package that we got. <laughs> the target is a briefcase. Discretion is of essence. Leave target at point F32 inside the dumpster. Okay, so I guess that's from dumping, dumping bodies. Failure is not an option. We'll be watching you. Oh, jeez. Uh, can I go? No, I can't go that way. Gee, that's really scary, actually. Uh, that, like, there's just people watching, you know? Here, oh, cool. And he's got a DeLorean. That's right. Look at this. We get in our DeLorean, and now we go to the prelude, the Metro. All right. I think, yeah, okay, so this is the character select, or the mask select, I guess I should say, and each mask will have different, uh, little perks to them, right? This is the only one we have at the moment, so we gotta wear the chicken mask, Richard. Alright, let's, uh, let's kill some dudes. Can I? Okay, my middle mouse button isn't working great, but we'll try this. Nice! Look at that, oh. Crazy. Alright, here we go. Big time. Oh, look at that. So yeah, I'm kinda aiming with my mouse. And then I use the WASD keys to move around. And the game is really fast, and it's just like, it's a treat. Uh, what, what the heck is this? Are we like a subway station? We are at a subway station. That's why they called it the Metro, didn't they? Is that it for this floor? I guess so. Okay, here we go. Round two. Ready? Bam. How do you like me now? How about this one? All right, two guys in here. I'm going to get this one in the door. Bam, bam. Oh, no, he got me. <laughs> You're dead. Okay, we're gonna go again. So this game too, it's quick. You die fast, but then you just jump right back into the action, and it's awesome. Dead. Check that. Ah. Okay. <laughs> I have to be smarter. So far, off to a rough start. But that's, you know, to be expected here. Okay, here we go. Oh. Oh no. Jeez. Oh. Get out. Oh, he, he one-shotted me that time, guys. Pretty much all the enemies will kill you in one hit, so you have to get them before they get you. That's kind of the game here. Uh, take that. I'll wait for this guy, or maybe, can I go up here? There's like a bunch of guys up there, I think. I wonder if I could go and just hit this guy really quick. Bam, how do you like me now? 
Oh no. Shit. Okay, that wasn't a smart way to go. Ah, oh, damn it. Alright. I'm pretty- I feel pretty, uh, oh. We both somehow killed each- oh no, I didn't- he didn't die. I thought we were both dead there for a second, but it turns out he was just playing possum, it looks like. Dead. Dead. Okay. This is the big one. Bam. How do you like that? Okay. Now this guy, I'm gonna throw the bat at him. Boom. I've missed. Somehow. <laughs> how did I miss? Oh, I don't know how I missed. He's dead. He's dead. This one's gonna die. Right now. Dead. It's not good when I'm on the first uh, room and I can't do it. That's usually... Okay. He's again playing possum, isn't he? I knew he was. This is not a good sign, guys. This is not a good uh, a good start, but it'll have to suffice because this is all we have right now. Um, geez. Okay, there you go. You're dead. And this guy. This is the troublemaker. Bam. Look at me now. Look at me now. Killing like I was born for it. Okay, this is going to be hard. So I can, if I press shift, I can look up here. One guy's got a butcher knife, one guy's got a bat. So, I'm wondering, maybe I can just like pull this guy to me. Oh god, they're both coming. Okay. Yep. I got them both. Wow. That was cool. I'm going to get the, uh, there's a the baseball bat. One of them had a knife, didn't he? There's the knife. Yeah, let's use the knife. I don't know if this is going to be better or worse. It looks like it's a little shorter. Oh. I didn't even check to see if I needed to talk to that guy. I just assumed anybody you see in this game, you basically just kill. So now I got to get back to the car. Well, the screen's shaking like crazy as well. Okay. Oh, the bus. People are getting off the bus. Oh, no. Can I... Let me get back. Uh, no. Leave me be. Nice. Bash his head in with the briefcase. Wow, that's sick. This game is really gross, by the way. God damn it. All right. I could just probably not kill him, but I don't want to not kill these dudes. Like, oh, okay. So he he runs over there right away. I gotta play this a little smarter. Let's uh, let's pick this knife up. Can we pick the knife up? We can't pick the knife up. Die. Get bashed. Get bashed. Get bashed. Oh, there we go. All right, stage is clear. Now we can go to the car. There it is. There's the DeLorean. It's all fueled up, it's ready for us, and this looks like the dumpster location I think they were talking about. Yes, it is. Who's there? I can hear you. I know you're there. Alright. You know what, guy? You're gonna die. If you think you're not, you're crazy. Can I lock on can I lock onto this guy? I don't think I can. Oh, I am gonna take his bat though. First I'm gonna smash his brains and then I'm gonna take his bat. I got his bat. We got a bat. Oh, and then I get sick. Wow. So he does all the he does all the killing, and then he just throws up, with no real rhyme or reason why he does it. He's just a just that kind of guy, I guess. Just one of those you know bubbly characters that uh, that does that kind of thing, and that that happens sometimes. You know, no big deal. All right, I got a C plus, which sucks. That was cause, probably because I died so many times, and I um, also just. That was pretty basic, I will say. I'm kind of getting back into the swing of things here. I don't remember any of the layouts or anything, guys. So um, as much as I did say I played it before, uh, I don't remember any of it. So we got Rasmus. He's an owl. Um, and now we are at what looks like a convenience store, I think it is. Let's talk to this guy. Hi there, man. Haven't seen you around. <laughs> Thought something might happen to you. You seem really down over losing your girlfriend. Don't remember seeing you after that. I guess it should be more of a hippie, shouldn't it? It shouldn't be like such a down south dude. Maybe it's like a down south hippie. Maybe we should talk about something else, huh? So out for a midnight snack, huh? Oh, don't worry about it. It's on the house. <laughs> Good to see you. Have a nice night. All right. Um, I'm not going to be doing voices. As, as it turns out, because it's just kind of crazy. It looks like I picked up uh, some Sprite or some, like, Sierra Mist or something like that. This video brought to you by both Sprite and Sierra Mist. Not actually. I don't want to get sued, um, but it would be, if those guys, uh, whoever, I can't remember who owns it, but if those guys want to uh, do some product placement, um, I am, my email is available um, in the About section of my channel, so feel free to contact me. Um, regarding any product placement you might want. All right, here we go. Um, you have one new message. Hello, it's Linda. I need a babysitter. 
right away. Got a few kids that need to be disciplined here. I'm at East 7th Street. Make sure you have a long talk with them. I really need someone to get through to these rascals. And like last time, please be discreet. Wow. So it's just, you get, this guy just gets weird phone calls, right? He's hanging out at his apartment. He leaves all the doors kind of wide open. Looks like he's got some sort of, um, what is that? Nintendo Entertainment System or, uh, oh, something of the like. Um, and he's got like a little tanning bed here. Uh, and also a regular, oh no, that's maybe his dresser. I don't know. Clothes strewn all over the floor. It's about right. It's about what I'm living like. Kind of looks like my apartment, actually. It's really crazy. All right, so um, here's our kitchen. Let's get out there. Let's go do another one of these. Uh, just, just go kill some people for for someone. Does he get paid? I mean, that's like never really. He didn't seem to really get any money from the last one or anything. So it's weird. First chapter. No talk. Okay. I can. Should I not talk for this entire run, you guys? I don't know if I can do it. I don't know if I can handle that. Alright, an eye for secrets. We're going to use Rasmus this time. Uh, East 7th Street. Okay, so... What's up? Oh, we're going up here. Okay. Um, oh, and the music in this game, guys, is the best music in any video game ever. And I'm not, I'm not even trying to be exaggerative when I say that. I mean, I, this to me is my favorite soundtrack of any video game ever. Uh, it's so good. Just kind of turn that up. Damn. So good. Okay, this guy's got a gun. What's up here? Oh, jeez, I shouldn't go around corners blind like that. It's one lesson we will learn. Oh. Oh, oh that was close. Okay, there's a lead pipe. There's also a gun here. Maybe this is going to be the only way to get this guy. I'm going to lock onto him. Bam. How do you like... Oh, I got him both. Oh, shit. His friend's coming. Eat shit. Oh, nice. I got two rounds left. Or no, I have zero rounds, huh? Yeah, I've got zero rounds. Okay. Uh, let's keep using... I mean, I don't know. I, I kind of would rather not use guns because it's not as discreet, but... Let's, let's go the discreet route. Let's go for lead pipe. We're going to chuck it at him. Eat shit. Oh, Nice. That was pretty easy. Okay, we're going to take the gun with us on the way out, though. Because you never know. Ugh, I can't... Okay, there we go. See, this guy was just sitting here on the couch doing nothing. Just listening to some, like, four tracks and some records over here. And then, all of a sudden, some guy just comes in with an owl mask. And, uh, that's how you go. Sometimes that's how it happens, though, right? Like, you're just minding your own business. And then some psychopath comes in and you're dead. I, I, think about this right now. Are your doors locked at your house right now? You don't know. It could happen as you watch this. <laughs> Try not to think about that, though. Uh, that was a good run. We finished the first level, which is really cool. Uh, let's see if I got better than a C+. I got a B this time, which... That's great, right? A B. Man, listen to that music. Oh, that's great. I got a new mask. Also, I got Tony the Tiger. <laughs> Tony the Tiger. Also, um, anybody from Kellogg's Frosted Flakes, um, I am uh, willing to sell uh, anything for you guys um, so I can make some money because that would be really cool. So go ahead and you can contact me. Uh, my email is in the uh, about section of my channel and I will definitely give you some product placement. Oh, let's talk to this guy. Looks like we're at a pizza parlor. Hey there, welcome. Oh, you don't need to order. Your pizza's already done. Had a feeling you were on your way here. <laughs> well, let's just leave it at that for now, shall we? Don't worry about paying. It's on the house. Oh, there's a pizza. I got a free pizza deal. So I guess do a contract, get like some Sprite, and then the next time you get a, a, a delicious pizza, probably from um, Papa John's or Pizza Hut. Again, uh, email in the in the about section. All right, next bit here, April 16th, 1989. Um, here we go. Uh, got a message. Is there anything else like that I can do in the apartment? I don't think there really is. We got a message. You have one new message. This is Thomas from the Methadone Clinic. We've scheduled a short meeting for you tonight. We're at Northwest 184th Street, apartment 105. And don't worry, we know discretion is of importance to our clients. Click. Ooh. All right, so another uh, would-be 
I, I use the word contract fairly loosely because I don't know. All, all I'm getting is like junk food. Like this guy just kills for junk food and the, and I guess like the pleasure of um, watching someone uh, die. Oh, this this episode's called Overdose and we're gonna do um, Fists of Fury is what Tony. So I imagine his unarmed strength is like pretty strong. He's got an eye for secrets, which I'm not sure. I'm not sure what that means. Um, well, let's go ahead. Let's use Fists of Fury. He got, he's our new character. Can I go around the building? Oh, it looks like that's about it. Okay. This is awesome. All right. We're going to get this guy right off the bat. Bam. How do you like that? Dead. Oh, his friend's sitting here. Looks like he's um, he's not quite on the toilet, but he does appear to be taking some kind of shit. All right. Here we go. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> let's go again. That's no problem. See, that's I, that's that's the thing about this game. It doesn't matter how much you fail because you always just come right back in, big time. Look at that. Nice. Okay, what do we got going on? Okay, we got one guy with a gun. One guy taking. This guy is actually taking a whiz. Um, bam. How do you like that? And it somehow didn't alert him. He's still just smoking his cigarette, looking the other way, staring at the wall, doing nothing. It's amazing. All right. Uh, you know what? Discretion on this one. Let's go discreet. Use the lead pipe. Bam. You're done. You're done, son. You too. No! Oh, he had a gun, guys. How was I supposed to know that? Okay, so we're, we have to start all over again. Wow, I, like, stabbed his neck? Maybe? Wow, this game is really violent. Okay. Bam. You're done. You should come down here, but you're not going to. All right. I got five rounds. I'm ready. Bam. How do you like me now? And this guy's got to go right away. This guy just... Everyone seems to be uh, a bit hard of hearing because I don't know how you would not stop taking a whiz after you heard somebody get shot like a room away from you. All right. Oh, oh. Okay, there we go. I knew he wasn't dead yet. If you don't see blood, he's not dead. Oh, this guy's only got one shot. He's got six. That's a little better. So which way should I go, left or right? Uh, we're going to go left. I don't know if that was a good way. Oh, 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 oh. That was an accident. Yep, I didn't mean to go in that room. Okay, I got an idea. I got a slick idea. Now, one thing I can do, uh, I can actually hit him with the doors. Um, there are going to be times where I end up doing that. I try to not do that. I, it seems a bit cheaty. I, I don't know. Like, it, it kind of seems like you're, like, cheating the game a little bit when you do it. I'll show you one right now. Oh, there's two of them. So, if a situation where there's two of them, then I'll do it. Oh, and then I'll die. <laughs> I should have thought that one out, like, a little bit better. Okay, so there's this guy... We're going to throw our gun. Get thrown. Okay, pick my gun back up. Maybe I should take the... No, you know what? We are going to take the gun. And we're going to... This other guy walks in, though, which is makes it really difficult. Maybe I should kill him now. Oh, God. That's going to alert everybody, I would imagine. But it didn't, which is fine. Bam. Oh, no, no, no. Gee... Oh, that was, <laughs> that was really crazy that time. Okay, let's see one more time. Dead. Everybody come in. Just come in and die. Just stand in a line and die. I got two shots left. One more. Got it. You're dead. You're all dead. I think. Let's take the pistol. 13 rounds, or was that a pistol? It looked like a pistola. It is a pistol. He's holding it one-handed. He's got his hand up on his other hip, like uh, like he's doing the dip. Uh, all right. <sighs> Fuck off. Nice. Oh, it's silence too. It's just so the pistol would be real good because it's got a silencer on it. So it looks like I can like maybe be kind of discreet with this actually. Ready? Boom. Oh, well, that guy took two shots, which was kind of weird. So the pistol is also a little weaker, which makes sense. Um, it looks like there's only this one baseball bat boy left. Oh! Nice, okay. Let's go back upstairs. Uh, we're taking... We're going in again. We're going to try to be discreet. We're going to take the lead pipe. Or whatever that is. I think it's a lead... Oh. That was all I... I just had to kill those guys. I thought there was like a whole other section to it. I guess that was it. Alright. Wow. So, yeah. That's... That was pretty cool, actually. I... Usually it takes me a lot longer. So that, those these first couple levels, 
are a little bit easier. I do remember that. They do start to get really tough eventually. Anyway, guys, I think I'm going to end it there. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.